Hi guys, welcome to another episode of How to Tutorials by Level Notion Studios. This is Super Sam once again, and in this very episode, I'm going to show you how you can change your weight paint color here in Blender. Let's get started. So to change your weight paint color, all you want to do here is, uh, I'm going to select the character and go to weight paint mode. This is the default weight paint color here in Blender. You have a gradient from red to blue. Red means a weight of one and zero means a weight of zero. But if you wish to change this color for God knows why, um, you can easily do that in Blender. For example, those who are from the Maya background are, are probably used to seeing their weights in black and white. You can do this in Blender. And if you want to be a crazy artist like many of us, you want to design your own gradients. You have the freedom here in Blender. How beautiful and awesome the Blender software is. All right, so um, click on Edit, Preferences, and this is where the magic happens. So go to Editing and scroll down to where you have Weight Paint. So click on this drop down, and uh, I would like to drag this down so you guys can see clearly. Yeah, so under the uh, weight paint, this is where the magic happens, right? So I just want to click on this. So use custom color. So as soon as I clicked on this, you can see the feedback immediately. So white to black gradient. And if for any reason I want to change the color information, all I need to do here is just click on uh, one of the, the uh, paint here and then change the color to whatever you want it to be. So. I'm also going to change this as well. So, a bit red. Okay. All right. So, I'm going to change this black to maybe something. Uh, okay. I mean, this is just crazy. I'm just uh, going all crazy. So, what if you want to add more um, points in between? You can easily do so by just clicking on this uh, positive sign here. So, when you click on that, it has another point for you, you see? So you can click on as many as possible, okay? And uh, you can easily change the color as well by just clicking on the color, come in here, and then change it to whatever, okay? Make that blue. Red. So I'm trying to get out uh, very distinctive colors. Okay, maybe that. And I think that's all. So this is how you do it. Come over here and save your preferences if you want to. So I'm going to call it a wrap here. I hope you've learned one or two things from this video. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to our channel if you've not done so. And until next time, keep your creativity blended.